It can feel like the search for a unicorn, finding foods that are tasty and satisfy your appetite, but also fit into whatever weight management goals you've got. To share her picks for menu planning and working out, health and wellness expert and certified personal trainer, Andrea Metcalf. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, it's so hard to navigate that grocery store sometimes mm -hmm. when we see those labels that say light. And so I really want to get people to start looking at the labels, not only for the protein and fiber, but for the ingredients. Let's mm -hmm. go back to old school and just look at the words. And if it's words like sucralose or potassium sorbet lala, if you can't pronounce them and you're not sure what they are, a good rule of thumb is to just not eat them. Uh -huh. And that's why I teamed up with Chobani for this. The Simply 100 is a 100 calorie Greek yogurt with all natural ingredients, no artificial sweeteners, no artificial preservatives. So it's one of my favorite picks on the list, if you will. Mm -hmm. What you're saying is I love to do that. Like once, because you're not reading labels every single time you go into the grocery store, but like once you find the product that you know what it's about, you know you can trust it, and then you just go straight into the store, grab it, and go. So um, what, do you, what do you like about this yogurt specifically with smoothie bowls? Because I know those are trending right now. Smoothie bowls are trending, mm -hmm. and with the Greek yogurt, you're getting an excellent source of protein and fiber. I think that's what really sets this one apart. Not only that it's all natural ingredients, but you don't find many Greek yogurts that are 100 calories and have five grams of fiber. Fiber is really important because that keeps the body moving on the inside, and when you have to remember to keep the body moving on the outside, too. <laughs> right. So what are you putting in your smoothie bowl, Andrea? Well, this is a peach uh, 100 calorie smoothie. Well, we actually have a couple of them yeah. in here. It's all blended. It's delicious. You know, some other things to think about is the taste of what you're putting into your body. You don't want to sacrifice taste. And what I love is Chobani's new innovation on the Simply 100 Crunch. They have a blueberry, a mango, a strawberry chocolate truffle. I mean, these sound like desserts, and they taste amazing. I was kind of sneaking one in on the break, <laughs> having a little bit of yogurt myself. Are you dressing yeah, it up? Because it keeps me going. Uh-huh. Do you dress it up oh, with Oh, my stuff? gosh. Well, you, you know, the sidecars, you dump them right in. Okay. And so you've already got that cookie crumble, or you have the chocolate. And that's what makes them really unique. And again, they're only 100 calories, and they still have that protein and fiber. So that's one of the things I really love about the smartness of this product. It's easy, grab and go. You, you can trust it because it's all natural. And, you know, there's, there's other things that I really want you to keep in your kitchen as well, besides Greek yogurt as a staple, beans, avocados. You need that good fat, fiber, and protein, and that's what these products all offer. Mm -hmm. What about working out, whether you um, are trying to lose weight or just maintain weight loss, um, are there certain exercises that you feel like are really universal? Well, I think that most people aren't going to always pack a gym, uh, pack a gym bag and, and get out there and exercise and do weight training. So there's some three simple things I can tell you. One, if you stay with the 10 minute rule of walking 10 minutes before or after every time you eat and doing that daily, that's going to help your heart and that's going to help your weight control as well. But another thing you can do is during commercial breaks, take that 30 seconds to two minutes and try things like a plank walkout or an inchworm. We also have tuck jumps that will help strengthen that lower body and it's a high intensity move that burns calories. Or you can really go to it, get down, go into a plank, try one push up, jump back in and jump up for burpees, the old school. And there's nothing wrong with dancing. You know, we see this all the time that <laughs> right. dancing burns calories. When people do the dance competitions, they lose weight. Dancing for 30 minutes can burn about 150 calories. Wow. So easy ways to sneak it in without feeling like you're exercising. Yes, keeping it fun. Boy, I've noticed that makes a difference for me as well, Andrea. Thank you for joining us. It's good to see you. Thanks, Mary. And check out Simply Chobani 100, Simply 100, Chobani Simply 100.com <laughs> for more information. We'll or get that to you. I like to hit up the search engines and just type it in and go. Uh, thank you, Andrea. <laughs> there we go. Chobani, you'll find us. <laughs> That's easy. Mike, over to you.